the sir sir what is you doing you didn't need to do all that he did not need to do all on this bins okay it just tastes I really don't care what none of you say. I don't care. I don't care. It's safe to say I made a friend. Love yours. Love yours. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. Love yours. I don't know how dry my face is. Well, good morning. It is seven, seven fifty-nine. I have brushed my teeth. I didn't get to wash my face because Kylo was all up in my space, wanted to touch the water. And he was already dressed for daycare, so could not let that happen. I'm gonna go back in and do my face in a minute but Bruh. excuse me we're taking our vitamins hey good morning i'm gonna take this because it's good to take it on an empty stomach before you have your breakfast so i'm gonna do this two of these gummies and honestly, I've noticed a difference in these. And biotic. Let's get started with this. It just tastes, it's the aftertaste, I'm not a fan, I'm not a fan. When it comes to that, it's the aftertaste. I'm not a fan of the aftertaste, however. So because breakfast options are limited at this time, I'm gonna have a smoothie for breakfast because I cannot do the pre-workout on an empty stomach. I look like Casper the why? Gosh, give me my color, please. Ooh, those other clips are gonna be scary. That is just ash, and oh my gosh, I can't stay in front of this camera like this. A while back, I went to Costco and bought like these big, a big bag of frozen fruit, and. <laughs> Shameful because I barely touched it. Jelani has been the one that's really using it. I did not know that they were pre packaged like this. I did not know they pre packaged the fruit like this, so you're not like pouring it out and wasting it. You get like a pack, and this is enough for your smoothie essentially. So I'm gonna blend this up and yeah. We're gonna have a smoothie for breakfast so that I could have the pre-workout and not feel sick. So
her dry. Jesus. Oh yep, drink this. It is Tuesday. I don't know where I put my watch. I know. I'm gonna follow a. I mean, I have access to a workout plan, so that's what we are going to use today. I honestly just want to lift. That's what I really want to do today. Days where I'm going into the gym, I really feel like. It's not fun when I don't get to lift. I have a little circuit going that I'm gonna maintain for the next six weeks. I feel like it's been working, so you're gonna do that. So I have to clean the windshield on this bend, okay? Girl couldn't see your shit. To clean your windshield too. I have to clean yours. Oh gosh. On this bins, okay? This big body bins. I need to clean the windshield. While I sip this and you know, essentially wait for Joanna to get back. This is breakfast, in case you missed that part of the vlog. I put my pre-workout in here. I really don't care what none of you say. Pre-workout tastes disgusting. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care if it's Oxy Shred or whatever these influencers tell you. It tastes good. You don't really, it don't really taste anything. Or it's, it's an odd taste, but it tastes okay. It doesn't. It tastes disgusting. How was drop off? Uh, he's there. Did he fight the good fight? Hmm? Really? Oh, I might have to put that same song in the air. Anyway, let me do some editing before I go. I add this last track to the end, and then I gotta go. So, bye.
I just finished the gym. And as you can see, there's a smile on my face because I made a friend. I made a gym friend. Her name is Peter. She's so nice and cute. She's so cute. She's so cute and like little bits and oh my gosh. So I was doing the, I think it's called Bovarian squats. Anyways, one of the hardest squats. I, I struggle with the, these and why I've been avoiding them for so long is because I struggle with it. And today I'm like, let me go ahead and try. I mean, I've tried all the little hacks on how to like get my leg positioning right. And so she sees me do one set and she comes over and she's like, where are you feeling it right now? And I'm like, in my legs. And she's like, you are not supposed to feel it. You're like, supposed to feel it in here. I said, okay. She goes, I'm going to show you, can I show you something? Dope, show me. So she shows me, she basically tells me like, it's a rule of thumb, but sometimes you have to adjust. You can't just take it as that. And you also have to lean your body forward. I know it feels like you're going to fall. And I'm like, yeah, definitely what I was thinking. But she's like, no, you got to trust it. Lean forward and put down the weights. You don't need the weights. Just use your body weight and um, try to do it. And so I made the adjustments and I tried it. And when I tell you that motherfucker was burning, my thighs were burnt. <clears throat> my thighs were burning like who and I felt it where she said like it wasn't just my thighs my whole box side was burning my whole bum was burning and more than my thighs so the the, the pain it's like the muscle burn went was traveling from my thighs to my butt because I was doing it right and I was like whoo and she was like yeah that's that's what you want and so um she encouraged me to use the wall for support to get my balance like ma'am was super helpful and i am so grateful to her um because i was doing it wrong i was hurting my back a little bit but she felt the confidence to walk over to me and be like hey can i show you something you know what i mean some girl i, I don't even know her do you know what i'm saying and she managed to like come over and help me and I was so receptive because honestly that's just how I am if somebody sees something and can help me kudos like I will take it oh my thumb looked dirty for a second because I'm that way like if I see somebody doing something there's so many times where I've said something to help or I don't say nothing but that's just like how I am and it's so crazy because that's the energy I put out. And so today I got it back and she comes to me after I did it and she sees me being successful and all that. She was excited for me, which I loved. And she came over and she's like, you know, if you see me here at the gym and you have any questions, do not hesitate to ask me. I said, oh, dope. Okay. Got her name and everything. And did two more sets and decided, I mean, got felt the burn, did it right. And it felt so good and felt different, which I appreciate. So I seen her again at the gym, um, somewhere else in the gym. And I walked up to her and I said to her, like, I just want to thank you so much. I did two more sets and I have to say it made a huge difference. And I'm super grateful for like you deciding to come and say something to me because honestly, it's been a roller coaster. You know, I'm a, I'm a little bit of an oversharer. I don't do that too much on here, but I'm telling you I am in public. I am. So I just basically told her my little journey about how I like how I'm here now. And she was just so like, congratulations, super supportive. And I am just like loving the vibe, you know, the sir, sir. What is you doing? You didn't need to do all that. He did not need to do all. Anyway, so it was just a really cute funny like funny and dope conversation and i'm so so again i know you're probably not gonna watch this peter but thank you so much like i appreciate you and i made sure i told her to her face that i appreciate her for even saying something to me like making that much of a difference i appreciate it and um i'm definitely taking you up on that offer like if i see you here and i have any questions i'm definitely taking you up on that offer sis okay taking you up on that offer um you don't know what you opened and i said it to her too i said you don't know what kind of worm you just opened because i'm gonna ask it's safe to say i made a friend
I made a gym friend at that. And she cute. And she grown. I made a grown woman friend. I'm such a grown woman. Like 30. Come on. Get here already. I'm excited. I made a grown woman friend. Like, I made a grown woman friend. I'm so excited for myself. Cute lady. Like, such a cute woman. I love that. Oh, that was a mouthful. So, we are at the grocery store now. I don't know if you can see the no frills in the back. We are at the grocery store. <coughs> <clears throat> so I'm gonna go inside and um I think I need a loony for the cart and uh get some stuff. I need to get some stuff. But yeah, I just have to tell you guys about that experience because it made me so happy. I even called Jelani. I'm like, I know I'm such a like someone's probably watching this like you're such a loser. It was one interaction. Nah, like you had to be there to get it. You know what I mean? I'm trying to explain it to you, but you have to be there to get it. And so grateful for that i'm grateful to god and divine for like the spirits that they put that they place in my life and like not that she's in my life like that but you know like the people that i encounter sometimes i don't vlog them because i don't i feel like it's so hard to create genuine moments when you're vlogging um unless it's like at an event where you're required like you know to you know vlog but i have really beautiful genuine interactions with people on a constant basis like on a constant basis and i try to let those interactions trump the negative interactions that i have or the negative thoughts that i have or the negative experiences that i have with people because they're placed there i feel like to equal out the playing field they balance out my moods and i find the more of that positive energy and stuff that i put out the more it continues to balance me out until i no longer need balancing so um, I just want to share my perspective on what I experienced today. And I'm super excited. So we have recyclable bags. One whole sitting full. Do we need that many recyclable bags? Probably not. Probably not. Yeah. We don't really need that many bags. Yeah. Well, we're going to take it. Because you never know. Right? You never know. Anyways, I'll see y'all later again for the final time. Um, what veggies are we getting? Who gave us sweet pepper? We are. This is one fifteen. Got me. I think it's worth it. Don't be sleeping on your level, cause it's beauty in the struggle, nigga. Beauty.